so today I'm going to be doing the 7 Deadly Sins of Beauty Tags. This tags by Asian Purette and I, Purette, I hope I'm Purette, I hope I'm saying that right. I'm horrible with pronouncing anything. But she's beautiful, I'll link her down below, go check her out. But anyways, on with the tag, I'm going to be reading the questions off of my phone. Also, if you're wondering, I will, li I will link where my phone case is from down below. It's kind of dirty right now, so I don't want to go too close up because I have to clean it. But I will link where I got it down below. So number one, greed. What is your most inexpensive beauty item? What is your most expensive? <sighs> For most expensive, I would say, my, I want to say my Naked palettes. Um, I don't think I have anything more expensive. Um, my most inexpensive would probably be anything that I bought from e.l.f. Um, but the most inexpensive beauty product I use daily um, oh, I know what it is. Any of the lipsticks from Wet n Wild. This is mauve out of here. This is actually what I'm wearing today. Um, any of these lipsticks and any of their blushes. Heather Silk is my wild Heather Silk blush. Um, so yeah, the most inexpensive products I use daily would be those. Number two, Wrath. What beauty products do you have a love-hate relationship with? What products were the hardest to get? Um, I have a love-hate relationship with my Revlon Color Stay Foundations and the complete top like this broke off of this one. But they look like this. This is my winter color and my summer uh, my summer color and my winter color. <laughs> this is my winter color. Um, I used to adore, like I'm not kidding, be obsessed with these foundations. And I thought they were the best coverage. Um, they were amazing. But now they cake into my skin and they even doesn't matter how much I use. I don't know if I'm how I'm applying it. I mean I'm applying it pretty much the same way I use my stippling brush. But anyways, that has been two products that are the same product but different colors um, of products I have a love-hate relationship with. Um, the second part of that question, what product has been the hardest to get? I'm going to go with the Naked palettes. Not that these were hard for me to get. They just took me a long time to purchase because, um, I mean, it's an investment. It's $100. But, um, I mean, literally you'll use them every single day. Like, unless you wear bright colors every single day, these are colors that you're going to use every day. Um, number three, gluttony. What are the most delicious beauty products you own? Um, I went with my MAC Lip Jolie in Luxure. Let's see if this will focus. Um, because of the scent. Oh my gosh, I can't. And the color is just beautiful. Actually, should I put some on? Number four, sloth. What beauty product do you neglect due to laziness? Definitely my eyelash curler. Um, this is actually the Kirkland Borghese kit that everybody was crazy about like three years ago. I still have the brushes from that, not all of them. But this is the eyelash curler that came curler that came with it. And um, I just find that I don't really need to curl my lashes. Um, they're pretty curly on their own. So I don't find the... Five, pride. What beauty product gives you the most self-confidence? And that's definitely mascara. Oh, I just moved my camera. Definitely mascaras. These are my two favorites in the moment. Um, this is in my favorites video. I don't know which was going to go up first. Probably my favorites because it's already like November 7th, I think. But yeah, definitely mascara because especially now that my... F I just like skimmed my face with my nail. But anyways, um, now that my skin is a lot clearer because I've been using prescription um, medicine for my face, um, definitely I could go out with like no makeup but mascara and I would be happy. Um, number six is lust. What attributes do you find most attractive in the opposite sex? I don't understand why this question is in this tag. That has absolutely nothing to do with beauty. I don't really think that's anything to do with beauty. I mean, it has to do with good looks or like looks, but I don't think it, anyways. I would have to say probably either eyes or actually I think the overall face. Faces, like your face is what attracts me. Number seven is envy. What items would you most like to receive as a gift? Um, I would have to say probably a new set of brushes because I have such a mix of brushes um, that I'd like to have just a nice cohesive or just like one brand or two or three nice brands of brushes. Because I have, I've had some of my brushes for quite a long time now. And I won't buy myself brushes. Like, I just won't. 
um, I would rather like that was something that's something I'd like to have as a gift like a nice set of brushes like some MAC brushes or even like the real technique brushes or a Sigma brush kit I would love a Sigma brush kit so that's what I'd probably like to receive as a gift but yeah so that was the Sedley Sedley oh my goodness the seven deadly sins of beauty tag um I hope you guys enjoyed it it's a really short tag um I had fun doing it, so I'll tag some beauties down below, so go check if you're tagged, and um, definitely if you like this video, I tag anyone who subscribed to me who makes videos, wants to make this video, please leave it as a video response, response below, because I will like to watch it, and yeah, that's the 7 Deadly Sins of Beauty tag. So thanks guys for watching, and I'll talk to you later, bye.